And it was a big day for the Chabot Space Center in Oakland. It reopened for the first time in nearly two years. As KPIX 5, Justin Andrews explains, there's a new effort to get kids excited about STEM. The ribbon cutting wrapping up not long ago. That's where we were able to learn more about this new experience inside the NASA Ames Visitor Center before it opens. This is a, a, a day that's incredibly exciting. It's been 20 months since the center has been open and now there's a new experience. It's called the NASA Experience and said to feature some pretty fascinating items in space research. The center says most of these items have never been on public display, so the Bay Area is the first to see it. An opportunity to reach the community, especially the kids. We want to inspire the next generation of explorers. We want to inspire the kids, especially as they get into the middle school and high school levels where they decide what they're going to study in the future. Leaders say people will experience things coming to life, like the challenging and inspiring process of scientific discovery using real stories and people. The idea behind the NASA Ames Visitor Center's unveiling is to get more Oakland youth into STEM, helping them to one day chase their dreams of becoming scientists or maybe even an astronaut. It is part of a larger partnership to help area organizations re-envision in a new way of educating and experiencing. And when we use the word experience, we're talking about learning experiences, which includes exhibits, artifacts, hands-on learning activities, opportunity to meet scientists, research, researchers, and engineers from NASA Ames. So we think very broadly about all of the learning opportunities that we can create. Yes, we gave you a sneak peek inside, but you can come out here on your own later today at 5 o'clock. The doors officially reopen. In Oakland, Justin Andrews, KPIX 5.